Today we return to Hamilton, Montana to Super Pageants and we go to KLYQ, 12.40 a.m. This is one of the appearances in the week going up to the pageant. And, and, this is the Pageant Cast Gazette. Turn the page and you get our special report from the Minnesota and Wisconsin Collegiate High School and Pre-High School pageants that I was a judge at. That's all coming today on the Pageant Task Gazette. On the special optional day of the America's Super Miz pageant in Hamilton, Montana, we first stopped at KLYQ 1240 News Radio for the event show. Let's go into that studio. We're back. This is the event show on KLYQ in Hamilton, and uh, this is the weekend for the America's Super Miz pageant in Hamilton. Yes. Uh, the girls will be all over town. Uh, after we leave here, we're going out for coffee and then moving on to do a seatbelt challenge where we are going to be checking cars that drive down First Street to see who is actually wearing their seatbelt. And this is something we're doing for the Ravalli County Seatbelt Coalition. They're required to keep statistics on who is and who isn't. Um, and how many people actually are bothering to wear them because it is the law. Yeah, and uh, uh, in Montana, you, you aren't ticketed if you're not wearing a seatbelt unless you're picked up for another violation. And then if you're not wearing a seatbelt, they add on. So it's always a good idea to have that seatbelt. Actually, I was just able to watch a few uh, pullovers Yeah. because they video them. Oh, yeah. And the officer explained that he did see people without their seatbelt, so he followed them until he caught them doing something else wrong just so he could pull them over. Oh, my. For the other offense. Oh, there it is. Yes. Yeah. So don't think that you can't be pulled over for not wearing your seatbelt because they'll pull you over for the other offense and get you for both. Um, Stephanie, step on up here. You've got a, an interactive uh, a show uh, on the web, don't you? I do. I've been hosting Pageant Live. It's a weekly live internet show about pageants, and I've been so blessed since receiving the International Superman's title to really be promoting the pageant and, of course, the, the message of always buckling up. Four microphones, so we're going we're gonna to start over on this side. Come on over. And Hello. Hi. I'm, I'm Pam Kutzberg, and I am your Twin City Super Classic. Okay. And what I've created was the first Always Buckle Up bracelet ah, yes. as a reminder and I'm networking from state to state with different coalitions to see more of these to bring more awareness of how important it is to always wear your seatbelt. Okay. Everybody, every time. Every time. Every time you get in the car. Thank okay, you. let's move to you. Hi, I'm Alicia Nelson and I'm the Twin City Super Preteen. Okay. Come on over. I'm Nicole Maselli Pulowski and I'm Illinois Super Misses. Okay. Into that microphone right in front of you. Hello, I'm Tanara Jolie Greer, and I am Western Montana Super Preteen. Okay, and come on over. Hello, I'm Michaela Brewer, Oregon Super Teen. All right. Hi, I'm Sierra Waltman, America Super Preteen. Okay, into that microphone there. Got to move it on over. There you go. Hi, I'm Madison Bradford, and I'm the reigning Miss America Super Teen. All right. Yes, go ahead. You two in the in the front there. Yeah, both of you. Hi, I'm Tara <coughs> Lindbergh. And I am Midwest Super Preteen. Okay. Hi, I'm Grace Yaniak, Illinois Super Preteen. Okay. And Hi. Um, Go ahead. Hi, I'm Lexi Short, I am Super Preteen. Okay, we got the front row. Now we do the back row. <laughs> and I'm Wendy Lindbergh, Midwest Super Queen. All right. I'm Amy Yaniak, Midwest Super Misses. Okay. And I am Autumn Short, Washington Super Misses. Okay. And uh, that is that most of the contestants here? Have we got, have we got more coming, or are they all here? Actually, today is our optional day, so we will have more contestants showing up tomorrow. There will be 23 contestants altogether. Now let's take a look at what's going on at Amazon. Pageant girls are always on the move. You can use this Griffin Power Jolt Dual Universal USB Charger in your car to charge two USB devices, your mobile phone, your GPS, anything you can think of, or your friend's mobile phone and GPS as you make those appearances. Before you purchase something at Amazon, come to pageantcast.com first. Click the link that looks like this and we get credit for the sale and you help out the pageant cast. Thank you! Hope you're enjoying the pageant cast, the internet's first podcast dedicated to the world and women of beauty pageants.
This is Corey Ann Strupp, Miss Wisconsin Collegiate America 2013. Wishing you Tierra Dream. When you're center. As many of you know, I traveled to the Twin Cities of Minnesota recently for the Minnesota and Wisconsin Collegiate, High School, and Junior High pageants. I was honored to be on the judges panel, so I can't give you all the usual type of coverage that I did, but I was awful proud to send some great participants to the national competition. In Minnesota, our Miss Minnesota Junior High is Grace Krulls, Miss Minnesota High School is Kayla Kleinstuber. Miss Minnesota Collegiate is Sarah Jacquez. And in Wisconsin, we have Miss Wisconsin Junior High, Rachel Galecki, Miss Wisconsin High, Shelby Roykoff, and Miss Wisconsin Collegiate, Raquel Brunin. Congratulations to all of them, and a special thanks to director Susie Kearns for the great hospitality at the pageant.